Newport Optical Power Meter model 1830C. Uh, this meter is included with an 818 SL uh, detector, which is for a visible uh, light measurements. The range of this detector is uh, 400 nanometers to 1100 nanometers. Uh, the instrument can be connected to uh, a computer using IEEE 488 interface or RS-232 uh, serial interface and this instrument needs uh, 110 volts power supply and the GPIB address can be set using these uh, switches here so it's very simple uh, meter to, to power up. Let's press the red power button and it will first display self calibration and then the serial number of the detector will be displayed and also the wavelength uh, at which it is set now. Uh, these are the the front panel switches, uh, we can uh, operate it with a remote or local and the range of the instrument can be selected uh, auto so whenever there is a change in the intensity the range will automatically change from uh, watts, milliwatts to microwatts and nanowatts. For example, right now the ambient light it is measuring about 2.6 microwatts. I cover it with a black shield. It goes to nanowatts. The ambient light can be zeroed by pressing the zero button. The units can be changed from watts to decibels to in the logarithmic scale measurements are possible with this and also we can measure the relative measurements so a detailed manual will be included with this machine and uh, this particular detector comes with a calibration module which is already connected here at the input and uh, the backlight can be changed using this the backlight button the inten it can be no light medium light or bright light and there's a button for adjusting the attenuation and the units, you press the units, it will switch from watts to decibels to the relative measurements. Now there is a, the reference value can be stored at any point of time. And also a feature exists here, you can average the reading and dis display. Uh, you can do it slow averaging or medium very fast so the numbers will be jumping when you're in the fast mode also by pressing the lambda up or down button we can increase it keep pressing it till you reach to the, the wavelength you want to measure and then so also the range up down you can do the same so I'm going to just show how the detector looks like. It's a semiconductor detector here. And turn on my last light and let's see, see? When the scale is out of range, it will automatically change. And if, if it displays OL, that is overload, but it will, if it, in the manual range you mode, uh, you had to adjust increase the range but otherwise in auto mode you don't have to change anything now various other detectors are available uh, please check with us if you are looking for an 818 uh, IR detector. Uh, at times uh, we do 
have them with us and sometimes we list them as well. Also Newport Corporation still supports uh, with these legacy detectors. Uh, they do provide uh, uh, NIST traceability calibrated detectors and it's a very good meter to have one in every optical lab.